Hello, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and this is the Promises of the Bible. Philippians chapter 1, verse number 6 says this, Being confident of this very thing, that he, that he which hath begun a good work in you will perform it until the day of Jesus Christ. It is so important today to let the Lord do His complete work in your life. Now, from time to time, we deal with issues of hatred. There are actually people out there that instantly look at you and say, I don't like him. And they really don't know why they do, but they allow that first impression to uh, taint everything that they do when it comes to you. Well, in that moment, you have a decision to make. And that decision is, am I going to allow that dislike, that almost hatred, to uh, affect me? Well, you have to understand, God is doing a good work in you. And you must not allow others and their view of others keep you from doing that good work. And Paul says, he says, I'm confident that the good work that the Lord is working you, because realize this, it's a twofold effort. God is working in you through the Holy Spirit, and you are working on yourselves. You yourself are saying, you know what? I know that I need to live a righteous life. I need to live a godly life. I remember years ago, there was a friend of mine whose name was Gordon Weeb, and he used to sing a song that went like this, I want to be a righteous man. I want to be a godly man. Teach me to do all I can to draw me closer to you. What a great song and what great lyrics. God is doing a good work in you right now. And you must not allow the opinions of others to detract you from the wonderful relationship that you are working with in Christ Jesus. He says, because there's a good work and it's going to be done. And it will be formed in you until the day of Jesus Christ. When Jesus Christ comes back, whether it be through the portal of death or through the portal of the rapture, and you meet him, guess what? That's a good day. So the Lord's going to keep working on you until that very, very day. So let him do that. And don't let the, uh, the opinions of others detract you from that which is eternal. My name is Robert Dean Steele. This is the promises of the Bible, and you have yourself a great and godly day.